Hey, hi, and hello everyone, and welcome to my channel. If you are new to my channel, this is where I discuss how we can positively and beneficially affect our mental health with yoga practices, mindfulness meditation, plant-based eating, and more. And I highly recommend, especially if you're new to this channel, to go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell. I have a lot of important information coming up these next few months, and I don't want you to miss out on that or any other videos put on here because they'll be really beneficial on how to help combat things like depression and anxiety. Those are some of the things that I have been plagued with in the past. So if you have those kind of issues, this is the channel that will be beneficial for you to watch. Within saying that, I always will recommend talk to your doctor before starting anything I recommend here. There is nothing that can really replace um, any one-on-one -on -one that you have with your doctor and no matter what health advice you seek, whether it be a, even a holistic natural approach, it is always best to talk to your doctor first. So with that out of the way, I wanna talk to you about my favorite app. Literally my favorite app. Well, that's a tie up between the podcast app on, on, on Apple or the Calm app. I've been a meditator for 10 plus years and this app is what got me on the track to meditation. I had dabbled with apps in the past, but nothing has ever held a candle to the Calm app. Now that I've been using it for so long and it's 2018 and I'm always recommending meditation, I think it's best that if I really dive in and talk about why I love this app, why you will love this app, and the impact it's going to make on your everyday life because it's going to make a positive impact and I want you to be excited about it and I want you to download it right now. You will get a free trial and I highly recommend you download that free trial. You can cancel it anytime before they charge you. So what is, what is the harm in, in trying a, a seven day trial? in order to see how this app is gonna work for you. So I guess let's start off with this user interface. It has really improved. That's one thing I love about this app. From seeing it from its humble beginnings to where it has gone, it has grown into an amazing app. It's got so much content for you at your fingertips, but the layout and the user interface is really simple. It's got a minimalistic yet colorful layout, beautiful images, images and scenery. Immediately when you open the app, you will be given a scenery with beautiful soundscapes behind it. And you can go ahead and select a few different layouts or soundscapes or images that you want to listen to when your app opens up and when you start meditating. When you open the screen, you'll have a few choices at the bottom and one of them has your meditate button and that pulls up a library full of guided meditations and some without, with minimal guidance and without any guidance at all. I like using the no guidance most as I can because I wanna learn how to meditate on my own without somebody guiding me through it all the time, but I love the guided meditations on the app. It is relaxing, it's tranquil, and the daily meditations that they give you, they always have a, a moral or a theme to them. Tamara Levitt narrates the meditation, and she'll bring you in gently, and you sit down, and you start your meditation. It's usually about 10 minutes long for the daily meditation. She'll kind of talk about the topic of the day. You'll get about five or six minutes to meditate quietly by yourself and then she'll come back in and kind of talk and wrap up for the topic of, of the day. And she leaves you with something to take with you on your day. And it's wonderful because um, today's meditation was about kind of experiencing what you're feeling and not putting that as ownership on yourself. So like if I'm feeling irritable or anxious, I, that's not what I am, but that's just how I'm feeling or what I'm experiencing today. Another piece of content you have with the, is their sleep stories. And I don't know about you, but sometimes I have trouble sleeping. Two nights a week, I work till 9 p.m. And to come home and unwind can be a little difficult and challenging. When I open up this Calm app, 
especially with the background noise that they have picked. I don't know what it is. I love the falling rain scene. It instantly puts me to sleep. And if that doesn't work, try out some of their sleep stories. They are narrated peacefully and quietly. What I love is they even have stories for kids like Peter Rabbit and they are read quietly and gently and you end up drifting off to sleep and you don't even remember when you, when you fall asleep. Some of you ASMR heads out there will love it because they do have ASMR sleep stories. And if you love the tingles you get from watching YouTube videos with ASMR, you're gonna love the sleep story content on here. One of the most important features on this app that should never be overlooked is their master classes. I needed kind of a class on mindful eating. I tend to rush and slam, literally slam, everything that I'm eating. And that has a lot to do with my relationship with food. I've had a rocky food relationship my entire life. I've been skinny, I've been heavy all from having kids. And this master class, which the master classes are like podcasts. So they give you episode by episode. So they have a master class on here for mindful eating, which is narrated by Dr. Michelle May. So they actually have an actual doctor here to help you and give you advice on how to eat more mindfully. Another master class they have on here that I highly recommend is the Creative Living Beyond Fear, and that's actually narrated by the author of Eat, Pray, Love, Elizabeth Gilbert. Such an inspiring piece of content. It really gets you ready and fired up to start tackling whatever project that you've been putting off because you're too afraid to succeed, maybe. Whatever that fear that is going on in your head, this master class is definitely something you need to listen to because it's going to push you over the edge to continue going on your goals. Calm also recently just added a calm body, giving you daily stretches to do. Right now there's only a few on there, but I bet this is gonna grow. Open up one of the menus and there you will see all of your stats that you have ever done. What's wonderful is I originally started this, like I said, 10 plus years ago. This app has really become something special. I had started it on an Android and I had about two or three years ago switched to Apple. That was the app that I was most worried to lose. Lose all my data and information. I thought it wasn't gonna switch over right. Everything that I ever used on Android has switched over to the Apple platform and I'm so happy about it. And the wonderful thing about Calm is since I've been using it so long, they grandfathered me into the original subscription price, which is very good. And that is, the fact that they did that for me is the top number one reason that I will not switch apps. I will not go to Headspace, I will not go anywhere else because they showed me that my loyalty is so important, that they care about me as a user, that they're gonna offer me this really low price really low price still because I've been using them for so long. You'll see the stats and that encourages you to make some goals for yourself. So like my goal or the longest streak that I've had so far is 13 days. So I saw that and I said, okay, well, I'm gonna at least if anything, push it to 14. So that is my goal. I'm on day three now. Actually, day four, I did meditation before I started this video. So I'm gonna keep going for another 10 days at least, and that's my goal. So let's talk about some cons. It's really hard for me to make up cons on here because I love this app so much, but I don't know if I can make a video without with giving you all pros without giving some cons. One of the cons, which it honestly doesn't kind of apply anymore because they fixed it, but one of the cons was, since I started on an Android, I always had a running or Android platform. To otherwise, every month that my subscription renews on Google, on it's confusing how it works. Every time my subscription renews, it locks it out, and I have to open up a an Android platform to get all of my things to re-unlock again. So I don't know if that's because they fixed it or because I put the app on my husband's phone who still has an Android and it's always running so that way I never have to unlock it again. But it's working so I, I mean honestly it's not terrible. As, honestly aside from that I can't really think of anything because 
Anything that I would pull up in my mind as a con, like constantly runs in the background, I can go in and I can shut that off. So anything that I'm thinking about that might be in a little annoyance to me, they have a way to fix it on the app. So honestly, I can't really think of anything. I don't know about Google anymore, but as far as the Apple App Store, this app is Editor's Choice and it is number two in the health and fitness apps. And like I said before, they have a seven day free trial and you can cancel at literally any time. Some of these free trials that these apps offer, I will accept the app offer and I will cancel it two seconds later so I know that I'm not gonna be charged again because I don't know if I'm gonna like it or not. You can do that here. You're gonna love the app so much you're not gonna want to to shut it off. Even if I had to pay more for the app than I do now, it would be something that I would keep because when you're investing in your mental health, when you're investing in your health in general, there's nothing more precious that you can spend your money on that's going to benefit you tenfold outright. And taking care of your mental health is so important, especially in this day and age where we have a lot of social media influences that really are having a toll and effect on us. So why not? Take a chance on this meditation. This app is so special to me. I love everything about it. I highly encourage you to try it out. If you've never meditated before, this is the perfect app to get you started on a daily meditation practice. And as always, thank you so much for watching today. The awesome in me, bows to the awesome in you. I hope you have a phenomenal day and I'll see you soon.